Uh. Hey, what is going on YouTube? So in today's video, as you read on the title of this phone, this will be my last iPhone. And the reason for that is because Apple keeps increasing the prices, and uh, especially with their iPhones. So in this case, um, you know, as the prices keep going higher, it's just getting out of out of reach. I um, mean, you know, a phone like this is costing as much as a full iMac. But you know, with that, it's just it's hard to justify, you know, why someone should buy this unless you're utilizing it to its full potential. And in my case, I do as much as I can with it. Um, but it doesn't justify me spending, you know, the thousand plus dollars for this. That let's go ahead and just talk about this uh, unboxing here. It came in this package, FedEx, and then it opened it up here. Now, Apple does a great job with the packaging. Uh, it's just a plastic here, so it, it's actually very, you know, very good if this gets thrown around. Now, I did open it yesterday just to make sure I got. You know the right phone obviously it looks like a little bit bigger than like an I iphone 6 or 7 um but pretty pretty nice looking you know box here of course now it's a little bit different here because uh you, all you got to do is just you know there's a little tab here you just pull and it's pretty nice box again feels very premium as it should to the side so opening this up here opening this up there's nothing down here there's no padding no nothing and just like a, a regular you know iPhone any other iPhone you know you got the sticker there and yeah you know you got general paperwork right here put that up to the side so for those of you who bought an iPhone 7, it is really the exact same thing. They maybe just extended this box a little bit, and all this stuff here is same generic. Now, I do want to look at here the specifications of it. I want to look at the output. It's the same, 5 volts, 1 amp. Um, so this is just going to output 5 watts, maybe a little bit more. I know Apple tends to you know push this little thing to the limit so it's over a little bit over one one amp that it outputs so it's about a little bit over five watts that it outputs but I don't use these I only use these um, for family members who have phones that that can't take advantage of something higher than you know than one amp and it's very few nowadays so but I do have it just as a backup for whatever reason um, and then you got you know the lightning headphone jack or lightning headphones uh, and then you got that headphone adapter which is pretty sweet and you got a lightning cable and then you actually have the device itself so pretty cool as you can see I think it's really really sharp looking very clean uh, I like how when they put this there's no like bubbles or anything like that but it sucks if you know you spend so much time just to make it look like this because everybody's obviously going to take it off so kind of sucks if they spend a lot of time but if they don't then it looks pretty sweet as you can see here nice plastic let's let's hear that see if you can hear it So move that up to the side. Let's go ahead and take a look at this phone here. Now, this phone does have a glass back. Camera setup is, is different. So now when you're taking pictures, you know, usually I'm hoping you take pictures like this, um, you know, horizontally, not vertically. Um, now, another thing that little things that, you know, a lot of people don't don't really realize is as you can see, the earpiece here is a lot smaller compared to, like, let's say the uh, iPhone, the 7 Plus. iPhone 7 Plus is really wide, and the great thing about this is that this has 25% more volume coming out of the the speakers, and you know it is a lot smaller. So Apple really pushes their stuff, so that's pretty cool. 
so you got the standard volume up and down and then you got the you know the um, this is the uh, power button and it is a lot bigger going back down here you know you got speakers here I think the microphone and then the speaker or the other way around and of course there's no more home button it is a new iphone so it's a new experience and then of course you know you got the sim card tray and yeah let's uh go ahead and uh turn it on now again i, I did want to say that you know this phone is a very very beautiful phone so there you have it folks that is the unboxing of the iphone 10. i'm really excited for this new phone I do look forward to using it to its full potential especially now getting more into video editing on iMovie while I'm on the go of course I always prefer my iMac or MacBook but in tight spaces I'll definitely use the phone but thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel for many more videos like this and I hope to catch you in the next video.